Hey, good evening. So tonight I have a, a Seraphim on off for their newest comeback. So this was from uh, Weavers. So um, if you buy it as a set, then you got this uh, two photographs and a holder for it. So that. If I figure this one out. Okay. Oh, okay. There you go. Then you put one of these two photos on it as a stand. I suppose. Okay. So um, I was really surprised with the photo book. <laughs> Very small, um, which uh, makes sense because I noticed with the photo book, it doesn't come with any extras. And um, again, that makes sense because of how tiny it is, packaging wise, and everything else. All right, got a little slip cover, very nice. Oh, okay, so it starts uh, way back when with uh, Anti-Fragile. Then, yeah, their uh, first Fear Not. Very cute. Yeah, the caption says from Fearless. So I guess it just kind of encapsulates everything. Um, then here's Sakura, of course. Super excited for their uh, second Fear Nada. Really hope I can get tickets. Hopefully it's not too difficult. But uh, it's pretty competitive here to get tickets for things. Eugen. Okay, <clears throat> so, uh, of course, love the whole burnt angel wings thing. That was such a cool part of the music video for sure. Of course, Manche. Yeah, it's, uh, it says, Tada, this is me when I debuted. I've grown so much now. It's true. She definitely has. Yeah, a lot of these little captions are really fun. Uh, so, kind of like it a lot. And then the group photos. Okay. All 
um, yeah, I really, really like it. It's, um, it does, you know, gives off that feel if uh, you had your own scrapbook of things. It's kind of a, has that scrapbook feel to it, of course. But uh, really cute, really compact. But uh, of course, this package was the one I was really excited about. And uh, this is kind of the opposite. I was surprised with how big it was. I was like, whoa, it's, uh, it's a large kit. So, now, I always debate, like, should I take the plastic off already, but does it kind of remove the authenticity of an unboxing? I don't know. I guess sometimes I'll just have to deal with people struggle, seeing me struggle to open things up. Okay, so, let's see, is this a slip? Well, no, does it open magnetically? Okay, good. It's got a magnetic cover open, so magnet on this side to keep the lid. Okay. Wow, really cool. Okay, starting off the bat, let's start with the, it's like a door hanger style setup here. Seraphim item. Uh, yeah. It's really cool. So that has a QR code on the back. Um, I might have to, if you see a little split when I do the editing, it's, I might have had to remove a, the part where I showed the QR code, you know, just because I make sure I claim it. Okay, wow, so you got on and off, big old packets here, wow, okay. You have these little film strips for each member, super cute. Interesting little stickies from each member. So, super cute. More stickers. Chewan stickers. Sakura stickers. Yunjin stickers. So, Zua stickers. And then, of course, Manche stickers. Super cute. All right. Cool. Uh, looks like message cards. So, um, no need to. I'll just take them out, but, you know. Um, so, for a lot of these message cards, and other groups do them as well. Uh, I don't like to use, um, it's for each member, Chewan, Sakura, Yunjin, Kazuha, uh, Yunche. But, so I don't like to use a coin or other ways to uh, clear these off because I don't want to leave scratches. So I'll do those later. But um, I, I use um, nail polish remover. Uh, 100% acetone and so far um, hasn't damaged any of my cards that I've cleared the message cards off. 
So it comes with two sets of photo cards on and off, um, which I was glad about because, you know, a lot of times in packets like this, they'll they'll throw a thing where it's like, oh, you get one of the two. But I'm just glad they just gave both. Um, now we only need to buy one. So for the on set, love it, love it, the loose ties for uh, Sakura and Chaewon. Fantastic. Okay. And then off. So, all right. I guess Sakura's never off. So, still a suit on this one, but yeah, really cute. Kazuha. I'm sorry, Yunjin. Oof. Yunjin. Kazuha. Manche. The duck. Great. Okay. Uh, let's start with on thick. Wow, it's it's uh, it's kind of interesting. Like the uh, little photo book, I thought was kind of very minimalist, and then this is just it's intense. Honestly, the whole all the packets, all the extras, everything. So, and the quality really, really nice on this book. It's very nice. Okay, so yeah, really covers that fear nada, that previous one. I loved their outfits for Fiernada, especially Chewans. That was super, super fitting. They're a little interesting. I'm not a huge fan of how they did the split like this because I mean, the spine is in the way and I don't want to bend the spine too much on this so it's kind of an interesting way to do it um, but um, yeah it's kind of weird too I guess the format because I guess they were trying to put the on and off like this but I think they would have been better off just doing two booklets that are thinner but you know the length of this just because I think a lot of these um, images would have benefited from you know, not being kind of limited to this format and size. Like, um, you know, a lot of these photos would just look better on single pages. Um, so kind of smaller. So just give a little um, preference knock on that. But still overall, really, really pretty. Really nice. Mustache. Um, so far with this one, the previous one, I really do, you know, obviously it gives that uh, behind the scenes imaging, so really like it. And then the actual Fionata.
him. It's, uh, it's wild to think a year has passed since this. So. Then, yeah, just messages from all of them. Appreciate that they put it in uh, English as well. Okay, great. That was the first one. And then off. I think this is a little more. All right. Okay, so this is more um, their albums. Oh, there's debut. Wow, such a long time ago. Super exciting when they announced the team and they had uh, Chewan and Sakura, Yunjin, such big veterans. Then Kazuo, you just heard, you know, obviously her work with the National Ballet. Just, um, you know, how that would work out. Then Unche, yeah. Uh, she's been doing so great as a MC and everything else. Yeah, but to see where they've all come along from debut. It's, it's been wild. And there's Kazuo uh, with that ballet. It's really cool. Really cool. Yeah, it's just really the style. Just uh, you know, just really makes you nostalgic, obviously, for their pre-debut and debut. And just you know, obviously, where they are now. A little sad. Um, I understand there's a lot of controversy and you kind of... But, um, you know, for all the things prior to this, them cutting, obviously, not, not including any material with uh, Kim gone. So, I do wonder uh, how the members felt about that, you know, especially because they were in the middle of all that. Fearless. You know, I like their debut a lot, um, really, but I was also just, you know, getting into a lot of other groups at the time, too. So, you know, I liked them, but I honestly wasn't standing them that as hard uh, back here. And then, you know, all the thing with the drama again with Kim, so I was just like... Not paying as close attention. And then anti-fragile hit. And just, wow. Um, it's been standing them really hard since. Uh, anti-fragile is just it was amazing. Music video and song. And then just you know, all the others. All the other songs on that album are also just really, really good. So definitely... Anti-Fragile was the song that made me really pay attention. Just the music video was just so cool. Just, I don't know. The song was just amazing. And 
That's funny. I think one of the things I really enjoyed about it was just um, the pose was the, you know, where they, the muscle pose pretty much when you have that bicep pose. And I think it was just very appropriate for the group. They're just, they're just very strong. You know, just a very strong group, individually and as a group. Then Unforgiven, just continued. Uh, love Unforgiven. It's interesting to know, with Anti-Fragile, um, as much as, again, I love Anti-Fragile, the song, um, you know, my favorite B-side on that was No Celestial. And it was the same deal here uh, with Unforgiven. Love the song, but, you know, I loved Eve, um, Eve Psych and the Bluebeard's Wife. And so when they started promoting that, I was just really, really happy. with that cat. It's fine. Now, promos for Eve Psych and Bluebeard's Wife. That's where it ends. Um, wow, that's very, really, really cool and kind of, again, like very nostalgic feel feelings. Kind of happy to include this ribbon to like removing these large volumes easier. But yeah, um, so that was on and off. Um, Kind of a longer video and I definitely understand there's definitely parts where I'm just flipping through images. So hopefully it wasn't too boring, but uh, yeah, thanks for watching.